Yo, whoa, what was that? I think I just hit puberty. What's up, y'all? Cardboard Moses with you. Welcome. Uh, growing up right before your eyes. Time to do yet another eBay break. We're going to go ahead and do 2018 Bowman's Best Baseball. Four box, half case break, number 12. Oh, there we go. It's a little dark, don't you think? <clears throat> there it is. Let there be light. Very nice. Julio, let me grab the case. Bowman's Blitz. Well, actually, it's the last of the. Uh... It is the last of the case. So here it is. Oh, you already know, David. You already know. And uh, another quick little shameless plug uh, while I got you here. Check out our website, y'allripcitycards.com. New customers save $15 on their first purchase. All you have to do is register for an account, and you're good to go. I got one case of Bowman's Best Baseball. It's a full caser, mind you. I got seven teams left. I got Cardinals, Marlins, Mets, Pirates, Rays, Royals, and the White Sox. So if you're interested in getting to a full case, and why wouldn't you be? Check out our website, ripcitycards.com. New customers save $15 on their first purchase. All you got to do is register for an account, baby. All right, so let's uh, get this half caser going. But help me fill that full caser we got in the store. Let's open this up. Well, Justin, thank you for helping me fill the break, man. You did pretty freaking nasty with the Mets last night. You hit that Syndergaard HD and uh, the, the DeGrom to 50. That was very, very nice. If, if, you, if you really want to thank me, pick up the Mets and Bowman's Best number 15 in the store. See what we got here. What the heck? That's what I thought. Okay. All right, here we go. Whoa. That's no bueno. Is it this one? Yes. All right, let's uh, get that nice because that is clearly no bueno. That's perfect. There we go. All right, here we go. Good luck, y'all. Ah, still dealing with a bit of a cold. But I am getting better. If you're if if you're worried about your boy. Trevor Larnock, twins autograph. Kind of just scribble scrabble on that. We got Aaron Judge to 150 Yankees. Ozzy Albies, 250 Braves. Luis Escobar, Pirates Autograph.
ran Weathers, Padres Auto. Brady Singer Royals autograph cracked ice to 25. Mariano Rivera, the first ever player inducted into the Hall of Fame unanimously. The Baseball Hall of Fame, that is. Some people not too happy about that. I mean, he is a relief pitcher. The greatest relief pitcher probably that I've ever seen, for, that's for sure. Uh, but some people felt some kind of way about that. Clement's still not in the Hall of Fame. Bond's still not in the Hall of Fame. What y'all think about that? Adams Blue Jays Auto Willie Adams one fifty Rays Heliot Ramos Giants autograph. Yeah, Redbird, that is very true. How you doing, Richard? We got Jordan Adams, Angels autograph. I think I think they should have like their own Hall of Fame. You know what I mean? Cause not for nothing, steroids was a pretty big part of baseball. For a good amount of time. So I think they should probably have like a separate Hall of Fame for for, for steroid users, maybe. Mike Soroka, 250 Braves. Or, you know, put, put an asterisk next to their name. You're still in the Hall of Fame, but you know, you got that little that little asterisk there. Jordan Alvarez Astros uh, autograph. But yeah, Red Bird just is just like you said, man. I that's when I that's when I was watching baseball, when Mark McGuire and Sammy Sosa were were killing it, and you know for me, that's when baseball was like very, very interesting, like it, it was fun to watch baseball. I was a kid though, so like I didn't really have any sense of uh, of the steroids and 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 what they. Uh, well, what that could do to you, and, and et cetera, et cetera. But the game was fun. Like you said, it brought baseball back. So to ignore that era of baseball is kind of messed up. I, I think they shouldn't... Uh, I mean, I understand why they're doing it, because it is a an unfair advantage. But they should they should still be a lot in the Hall of Fame, you know maybe an asterisk or something like that. 
Connor Scott, 150 Marlins. Like they, 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 I don't think they still haven't let uh, Pete Rose in the Hall of Fame. And I don't think that guy took any steroids. He just, he just bet on the game. Noah Naylor, Indians autograph. Michael Jordan did the same thing, but nobody wants to talk about that. Christian Villanueva, Padres autograph. See, er everybody feels some kind of way. I agree with you, Blah Blah. I, my, that's my boy, though, so I'm definitely biased. Ken Griffey Jr. is my favorite baseball player. But to have a relief pitcher come in unanimously, I don't know, man. That's no disrespect to Mo Mariano Rivera, obviously. And arguably the greatest relief pitcher of all time. Uh, definitely the greatest I've ever seen. But to have him be the first unanimous player? I don't know about that one. Doug Eide says uh, Clemens and Bond should never get in. See, everybody, everybody, everybody uh, feels some kind of way about it. Nice. A red autograph. 9 of 10 Jeter Downs for the Reds. A little red on red action there. Very nice. Very, very nice. Doug Eyed with a nice stat. More people have been to the moon than people have scored on Mariano Rivera. That, that's a good stat. It's, it's a nice little uh, tidbit there. Flaherty, 99 Cardinals. But how many innings has he pitched? You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, man. Baseball's, baseball's a weird sport. Franklin Perez, Tigers autograph. Right, in the postseason. In the postseason, Redbird. Yes, this is correct. More people have been on the moon 12 than people have scored on Rivera in the postseason. But I meant, but again, he's a relief pitcher. How many innings has he pitched in his lifetime? Like, I don't know, man. Like I said, baseball, baseball is weird. You know, if baseball... What's up, kids play? My thing is this. If baseball really wanted to get rid of steroids, this is how they should do it. If you get found, you know, caught using an illegal substance or something via drug test or whatever, you're going to get banned for the whole season. The rest of that season, banned. If you get caught twice, lifetime ban with no, uh, with no chance of appeal and to get back in the game. Two strikes, you're out. I don't care. Simple as that. If you get caught once, you forfeit the rest of the season, and you don't get paid. Boom. You get caught twice, lifetime ban. If they really wanted to get rid of steroids, they, they should do something like that. Kyle Tucker, 250 Astros. You got to get these people where it hurts, the pockets. And not just the pockets, but these people are, they're competitors. They want to be out there playing. Evan White, Mariners autograph. I wonder how many people really used steroids in, in in the MLB. Like what percentage of players use it? 
or have used it or whatever. Matt Olson A's autograph. Damn, Ra Ra, eighty. You say eighty percent of Major League Baseball players have used steroids at some point. That's if that is true, dude. That is crazy. So everybody's you, yeah. Twenty percent. The other twenty percent didn't know they were doing it. So everybody's been on some form of steroid at some point. Kids play for life. During injuries, you have to use steroids. Dude, that's crazy. That is crazy. Last mini box right here. Jordan Hicks, Cardinals autograph to 99. You know what also hurts Barry Bonds? Not for nothing, but he, he's kind... Like, he has a reputation of being c c kind of a dick. So maybe maybe that's not helping his situation either. Jared Kalinick, Mets autograph. Very nice. And that's going to do it for the break. McGuire, not for nothing. Cool dude. I don't think I've ever heard anything negative about Maguire aside from the steroid usage. Other than that, cool dude. From what I, from what, from what I, I, I can tell. But Bonds, I've, I've read many a stories of him being a dick. So maybe that's why people are keeping him out. You know, not just the steroid situation, but also how he is as a human being. I don't know. I feel like you should just look at the numbers and. Barry Bonds numbers definitely mean he should be in the Hall of Fame. But that you know the steroids, man, that I don't know. It's it's a crazy, crazy crazy thing going there. Anyway. Kalinic Mets autograph, Olsen A's, White Mariners, Perez Tigers, Villanueva Padres, uh Naylor Indians, Alvarez Astros, Adams Angels, Ramos Giants, Adams Blue Jays, Weathers Padres. Escobar Pirates, Larnock Twins. We also got autographs for Jordan Hicks of the Cardinals to 99. Uh, Brady Singer of the Royals to 25. And a Jeter Downs 9 of 10 for the Reds. Very nice. And that's going to do it for the break. Thank you very much, eBay.